a K-Vision production. Backs against the wall. We should prove ourselves once more able to defend our island home, to ride out the storm of war, and to outlive the menace of tyranny, if necessary for years, if necessary alone. We shall fight on the beaches, we shall fight on the landing grounds, we shall fight in the fields, we shall never surrender. Well, that was quite something. <laughs> Welcome to London. Talk about being thrown in the deep end. We just don't know when Jerry's gonna have a crack at us. Oh, <laughs> no, no worries, sir. Uh, I want to get the authentic experience. Help to get a better picture across to the readers. Well, that was a fairly light rate from what they usually throw at us. But no worries, old chap. You got me to keep you safe. Thanks a lot, sir. I believe our inductions were cut short, weren't they? Indeed they were, son. I'm Andrew, journalist and reporter for The Guardian paper. But you can call me Andy. No more of this sir nonsense. Oh, uh, yeah, uh, thanks, sir, uh, Andy. I'm Robert, writer of the New York Times. Nice to meet you, son. I guess I'll show you around. The King's Head? Hmm, so this is your local bar, right? That's right, mate. Well, what's left to the sodding place? The water in hell for us, though. I see. Here, you wanted to hear what it was like from the mouths of everyday people, eh? Well, here you go. Meet Greg. Hello there, Andy. Where you been, lad? Ah, oh, you know, mate. Jerry keeping us all busy. How have you been? Not bad, son. Not bad. Business as usual. Look, I've got someone for you to meet. Rob Michaels. A Yank reporter, hopped over the pond to let his lot know what it's like over here. Hey there. Nice to meet you, sir. Welcome to Blighty, mate. Uh, thanks. <laughs> Looks like you guys have had it rough recently. Well, you know, nothing like the last war, that's for sure. War was fought on the front line, man. M mind if I take some notes for an article I'm doing? So, what are your feelings with the pressing advances of the Germans and the threat of invasion growing more prominent? Look. It's going to take a lot more than a few bombs to break our spirit. Jerry is underestimating us lot. Us Brits fight tooth and nail when our backs are against the wall. Yes, well, thank you very much, sir. Almost though, mate. Just round the corner. Okay, thanks for putting me up for the night again, buddy. <laughs> buddy, yanks. Again? They're getting more frequent. Come on, mate, get your skates on. There's a shelter at the end of this street. Ah! Oh, Andy! Andrew! Andy! Don't worry, son. I'm here. That was a close one. Hold on. I think there's someone over there. On the floor. Robert. Turn back, son. Oh, my lord! Nothing we could have done, mate. I knew this woman. Stronger spirit than most of us. You put that in your article. You let the world know they can't break us. Only gear us for a stronger hatred. Hatred that will be unleashed on the bloody lot of murderers. Just try us. Day one. Today was my first step into the war. I thought I was miles behind the front line. But I have soon come to realize that the front line is every day's people's streets here. The war-torn city shows signs of a broken nation. The citizens, they tell a different story. A nation not to be underestimated. A nation unbroken and staring the enemy down with a brave face. I'm not sure what the next week will bring me.
Backs Against the Wall, a radio drama for F FM, starring Jake Goddard, Matthew Spennywin, and Jacob Head, AK Vision Production. <laughs>